Great lads, my name is Edmaster and I'm going to give you a quick tutorial on how to record the RC505 MK2 loop station to your computer or phone. Now I don't have a computer to give you a practical example, but I will just give you a verbal explanation. Hi, it's Eden from the future, we just realised he's a complete idiot and we can use family laptop instead. I'll check back in with you once one of these two is installed first. Now one thing you should do here is go to menu, click over right once, go to USB and then set audio mode to vendor. But I suppose you should start off with the one I can give you a practical explanation for. So the process is pretty simple. What you're gonna wanna do is take your cable and plug it into the main output. It's this one right here. Done. Now next what you're gonna wanna do is get the other end of your cable and put it into the big hole on the iRig. Lastly, you're going to want to plug the iRig into the headphone jack of your tablet, of your phone. So this is my audio without the iRig. Now it comes to PC recording, it's a little bit different, but I'll still tell you how anyway. Hi, Future Eden again. Uh, so we're back with the laptop tutorial now. As you can see, I've swapped the RC505 for the laptop because I'd rather have this on my lap than that because that is in the namesake. I should probably get a computer table for the machine too. Let's get up out of this for a second. So recording the 505 to the laptop is really easy. You're just going to need a music software of some kind, your loop station, and this here USB cable. It should be USB B to USB C. I think that's the name of the I'll put it on screen if it's not. They're cheap enough. So first things first, you're going to want to make sure that the loop station is in USB audio mode. And you're going to want to make sure that it's in vendor. Next, you're going to want to take this end of the USB and plug it into the laptop. Next, you want to take the other end of the USB and plug it into the USB slot of the RC505 MK2. Ah, you hear that noise? That means it's connected, gang. So now we're all hooked up. But you might be asking, E, I can hook up with anyone, but I can't make a meaningful connection to them. How do I make this connection meaningful for the RC505 MK2? First of all, that's a very weird choice of wording. Second of all, I'll show you how. So right here, I'm loading up Mixcraft 9. This one installed first, so we're going to use this one. Alright, so here we are in Mixcraft, and I just got this set up already beforehand, so I knew what to do, but I'll walk you through it really quickly. So what you want to go to do, once you open up and you have your USB connected, your RC505 is in USB audio mode, you go to your settings, go to sound device, I'm going to hit digital audio interface RC505 MK2 USB audio. Now your playback can be whatever you want, you know, speaker to output, but I prefer to just send it to the speakers and laptop. Uh, once that's done, you're going to hit OK. Now I don't need to because I already have it set up. Then you're going to want to open up an audio track, go to ARM, this button, hit the drop down menu next to it, and select Digital Audio Interface RC505 MK2 USB Audio. What this button does is that it lets you hear the input as it's coming through the loop station. So I'm going to do that now just to prove to you that the loop station is recording. So as you can see there's no speaker or anything connected to my device. And three, two, one. Yup gang. But we're going to actually like record to this track, okay? So. Go all the way back to the end of the track and play it back. And that is input from the RC505 to your laptop. Oh, what you get? Back to your upstairs, currently. Right, so it's Sunday morning, and as I'm editing this, I realized the uh, audio for the outro is completely unusable. Thanks to Static. But you didn't miss anything, it was just me 
talking and there was static all over it and I was saying goodbye so that's all you need to know about recording your loop station to your phone, tablet or PC or laptop or whatever you want to record it to. You can record it to your Amazon Kindle I imagine if you try hard enough but uh, yep yeah, that's all from me. Uh, I will see you on Wednesday. Bye.